In this video, we'll be looking at using Unity's ML Agents with the kart racing game. ML Agents, or the Unity Machine Learning Agents Toolkit, is an open source Unity plugin that enables games and simulations to serve as environments for training intelligent agents. Agents can be trained using reinforcement learning, imitation learning, neuroevolution, or other machine learning methods through a simple to use Python API. In this video, we'll be exploring a simple integration of the ML Agents Toolkit to the Kart Racer microgame. The sample project includes an example scene, the ML Agents package, the Kart Agent implementation, a pre trained brain, and a basic racetrack. These assets are all available for free download at a link in the description below. We have provided an example Kart Learning Brain trained using the default reinforcement learning model that has been trained for a few hours. When we enter play mode, we can see the AI attempt to navigate the track. Let's take a look at how the Kart Learning Brain is controlling the kart. We have added a custom kart agent component that acts as a controller and linked it to the input field of the kart movement component. This replaces the default keyboard input component and allows our cart agent to control the cart directly. The cart agent component inherits from the base agent class. These top parameters of the cart agent component are inherited from the base agent class. They relate to the input of the agent and how it is trained. If you'd like to learn more, visit the ML Agents GitHub repository for more information on these parameters. The bottom parameters are custom fields we have made for this specific project. Our cart agent uses nine different raycasts to see the world. Each raycast is defined by a transform in our raycasts array. The cart agent uses these raycasts as input into the brain. At every step, the cart agent will see how far each raycast travels before hitting a wall, and then feed that number into the brain. The cart agent's brain will then process the raycasts through its neural net and output the acceleration and steering values for the cart. The brain used by the cart agent is defined by the behavior parameters. The behavior parameters define which brain model to use and how it functions. Our model is set to the cart learning brain. You can have multiple different brains for an ML agent. In your game, you may want to have different brains for different difficulty levels. There are many ways to train a neural net brain. We have provided a sample cart agent brain that has been trained in a basic reinforcement learning environment. Reinforcement learning works on a simple principle. The brain will learn by continuously changing its behavior, trying different things to maximize its rewards and to minimize its punishments. We have set the max step to 2000, which will end the training episode after 2000 training steps. We have set the cart to be rewarded in two different ways. Reward the agent a very small amount while it is moving forward. Reward the agent a large amount when it reaches a checkpoint. The cart agent is only punished in one way. Reset the agent if it touches a wall. To reward the agent while it's moving forward, we used the add reward function inside of cart agent, passing in cart.localSpeed and multiplying it by a small number. To reward the agent with checkpoints, we have placed checkpoints all around the track. We have created a reach correct checkpoint event on the track manager and subscribed to the cart agent.onreach checkpoint function. We have set up multiple cart agents that use these rules to run in parallel. Having multiple agents can speed up the training time. Each cart agent contributes its experiences to the same neural net while trying to reach as many checkpoints as it can. If we try out the pre trained brain, we will see the carts move along the track detecting walls and turning using its raycasts. We have trained the brain for several hours, and it can navigate the track, but it can still use some improvement. We encourage you to try training the cart agent yourself and to experiment with the reward structure. We can train our cart agent through the cart academy. The cart academy script inherits from the base ML agent academy class. It determines what parameters to run Unity in while in training mode and while in normal playback inference mode. We have set our time scale to a higher number, allowing us to run the game faster than normal and therefore speeding up training. Our Cart Academy will connect to the Python ML Agent API, feeding it the Raycast sensors we created. You will need the ML Agent Python environment installed to conduct training. With the ML Agent environment installed, you can monitor the status of the agent using TensorBoard during or after training. 
For more information on how to set up the ML Agent Python environment for your platform, visit the ML Agent GitHub repository, which is linked below. We hope that this project can help you get started with Unity's ML Agents Toolkit to help you create machine learning AI for your own project. We encourage you to download the free sample project and try training the cart yourself. Thanks for watching.